Total homeschool chaos. Oh my gosh. <laughs> trying to do homeschool in the hotel room on the first day of homeschool right now. I wouldn't exactly recommend it, but we're making it. <laughs> How you hanging in there, dude? <laughs> he says. Today's actually a really exciting day for me because it's my first official follow-up appointment at the Bariatric Medicine Institute in Salt Lake City. And so hopefully I get my staples out today. Uh, I get to do a whole checkup. Oh, I gotta get my heart rate monitor out of the car because they sent me home with a heart rate monitor and I, I forgot it. I need to return it today. But I'm uh, doing my first official weigh-in and follow-up visit and consultation. Uh, I get to meet with a dietitian and a fitness expert. They look at the surgical stuff that, uh, that I went through and make sure that everything is recovering properly and that I'm on track. And I get to find out exactly when I get to go to the gym and start working out and all that stuff. And I'm really excited to do that. I'm chomping at the bit to go start hitting the weights and doing all that. But I gotta make sure that everything is recovering and healing properly. But most of all, I'm excited to get on the scale and see how much weight I've lost since getting the sleeve gastrectomy here at the Bariatric Medicine Institute. Got it. See, it's a little thing that clips on your finger that uh, lets you know and make sure that your blood pressure is good, your heart rate's at the right level and all that stuff. Uh, these people at the Bariatric Medicine Institute here in Salt Lake City have been awesome. I'll put the links down in the description. So if anybody's interested in uh, weight loss surgeries, uh, different help and support groups and stuff like that, uh, don't, don't hesitate to click the links down in the description to check it out because these guys are pros and my recovery has been amazing. It's been really fast. Uh, I, I don't have any pain or discomfort or anything and so far everything is totally on track and I'm already losing a lot of weight so I couldn't be happier. I'm back in the little doctor's office for now. Say, check it out. So they just, uh, I actually just got on the scale. I'm just chilling in here waiting to meet, I think with the dietitian or a nurse or something to follow up with everything. But I, I officially got on the scale, fully dressed was 308. That means I've lost 26 pounds already from 336 to 308. And probably in the next like week or so, I'm gonna be out of the 300s. Out of, I'll be like 200 something. I'm, I can't even wait. I'm so freaking excited. All my clothes are starting to fit really baggy. Like once I get out of the 300s, that'll be like the lightest I've been in over a decade for sure. I made it back to the hotel. Everything's great. They took my staples out. Everything looks good. I'm healing up, losing a bunch of weight. I'm super excited. Everything's going well. How's the homeschool going? First day of homeschool? It's Right? Kind of boring, but yes. You guys' teachers are awesome? Are yeah. Cool. So fun. What's our teacher's name? You guys have the same teacher? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's convenient. That's nice. Huh. So. Is Kyle doing his homeschool over here? Yes. This is how to do school. Look at this. He's just chilling in the bed. Right? Homeschool for the win. Oh, the Zupa's aftermath. So, so good. I can actually eat the soup here and it freaking is amazing. It is amazing. I wish we could get sponsored by Zupas because it's healthy. Maybe we should it's buy. Like, that'd be fun. <laughs> buy a Zupas? Have, have oh, I'd like to buy a Zupas. Zupas? side of shoes. Zupas soups for days and days. There's a dinosaur, there's a dinosaur, no, another no, dinosaur no, over no, there. No, no. There's a dinosaur, another dinosaur. Hey, they do have one live velociraptor in a cage in there, and so that they've cloned from DNA off, that they got out of a, a mosquito that sucked the blood of one prim uh, primitively. I said Jurassic Park. Hey, I'll Ooh. Ooh. So don't stick your hand in the cages, okay? I know. It goes like this. Meow, 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 meow. meow. All right, let's go to the dinosaur museum. <laughs> Check this out. <laughs> if you guys have seen that at the museum, look. Yeah. It totally does, huh? Look at that. Yeah! 
What a cool playground idea. It's called the gyroid. It's a maze of twisting tunnels. It's just like the same shape of plastic and they bolt it together in different arrangements. So it makes like really cool tunnels and stuff. That's awesome. What a great idea. Check out this optical illusion. So that looks like a normal chair in the reflection. And then you actually look at it and it's like a <laughs> Look at the size Whoa. of that. Wait till you see the Velociraptor they've got. That's just nothing. <laughs> look at the salad it eats. Oh yeah. It looks like carrots and vegetables and spinach. Like out of a salad bag. You go down to Costa Rica and those things are running around in the wild like little dinosaurs running around. Ooh. These mannequins look real, huh? Yeah, it's like the, one of those guys. It just reminds me of Night in the Museum where it's like, they're gonna come to life. <laughs> okay, now that we spooked you, let's go in the dark tunnel into the dinosaur halls. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> bum, 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 Yeah, the Velociraptor might be through this tunnel. Come on. Let's go through the star tunnel. Ooh, this is cool. Wow. <laughs> They're convinced that there's a living Velociraptor in the museum somewhere. Way back. Look way back in there behind those trees there. Look, look, look. Look. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Do you hate me now? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I owe him an ice cream. <laughs> that was awesome. That was so awesome. <laughs> Dude, this place is awesome, huh? You can go through the tunnels. Secret tunnels. Quote Nacho Libre again in the vlogs. Nice. <laughs> Look at these. Can you imagine if those were running around today? How cool that would be. They're, um, they're, only if they were vegetarians. They're like little little lizard chickens running around. It'd be cool. <laughs> Whoa! Wow! Look at the size of that. We're in the Jurassic period. Very cool. These are all real bones, guys. Stegosaurus bones. Whoa, look, there's actual real fish in the water. Wow, there are. Very cool. Go down by the legs and see how big it is compared to you. Look at that. We're like the only ones here at the museum. There's nobody here. So sweet. Homeschool for the win again. Yeah. Go down and stand by the legs and see how tall it is compared to you. I know. Can you imagine being out in the forest and one of those comes walking by? Like a huge foot. Boom. I think one of those things crushing the <laughs> Those can eat meat. They probably eat elephants. Oh, I don't know. Imagine how big the poop is coming out of the bunghole on that sucker. As big as a car, huh? <laughs> ah, so cool, huh? You're standing under a giant long neck. Whoa! <laughs> this is fun, huh, Jen? Totally. Perfect age. Perfect. I know, right? Very cool looking. Wow. It's like they killed one another eating the carcass down there. Whoa, that's like an armor plated one. I know, it's called a gargoyle. Gargoylosaurus? Gargoylosaurus. <laughs> it's pretty awesome looking, wow. This place is awesome. Look at these, like giant spiked tanks. 
<laughs> Gastonia. Very cool. You guys have to build your own dinosaur, huh? Okay, whatever you say. Looks like a big chicken head. Hey, chicken head. <laughs> Whoa, T Rex. Giant T Rexes. Those are huge. Whoa, yeah. <laughs> that is pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, look at the size of that turtle. The Great Cretaceous Oceans. That's the Archelon. Whoa, that is huge. It'd be fun to ride on the back of one of those while it was swimming, huh? <laughs> That's cool. Okay, you know what's really weird about this giant turtle? Is that the fossils of the giant turtle were found in South Dakota. What? So the whole world must have been like almost completely underwater at some point. I don't know. It's crazy. Ginger, I want a pet elephant. A little little mini elephant. That'd be fun. Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> and a little and a giant armadillo you could ride around on. Armadillo? My pet armadillo? <laughs> Whoa! Megalodon! Holy crap! I know. I know. Don't you know? It's a megalodon. Wait, Holy. what was it called? I didn't hear. A megalodon. <laughs> <laughs> nope. 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 Nope and out of there. Kyle, do you want to go see the live raptor now? Yeah. The living one? Yeah. Guess what? There isn't one. I lied because I'm a horrible person. Now I owe you two ice creams. Yay! Look, the garfish you're eating. That was fast. And she just put these little goldfish in there. Little feeder fish. Oh, here it comes, here it comes. Oh. Oh. Oh, that one's a goner. Oh, oh man, oh man, the suspense. Whoa, oh, got oh, it. Like a little thick. <laughs> that was cool. That was fast. Watch him, watch him, watch him. Look at that. The fish is stuck in its mouth. Look at that. Look, it's like sideways in there. Boop, boop, boop. And yeah, now it's gone. Oh, no, it's... <laughs> that is crazy. Kyle, what are you working on? I'm working on a wall. A dam? Uh -huh. The water dam right there? Ooh, that's a good one. Looking good. Come on, walk around here. You guys are... Ooh, we're damming up the water. We got a straight line down here. And we have two, three dams. And we're trying to make a big pour. Cool. I don't think we need any of this. I think we do. Even Dad's getting his fingers wet. Well, it's important business. <laughs> we're trying to divert the water flow from this prehistoric pond into a river to see how deep we can get. I see. I see. When we started, he was standing on dry ground, and now it's up to his belly. Oh my goodness. Drowning the Brachiosaurus. He was on dry ground, and now he's sinking. Oh, help me. <laughs> After a long drive, we finally made it home. So that's the end of the vlog for today. Thanks for hanging out with us and going to our day at the museum with the dinosaurs. Make sure and click the i card to watch more videos. Turn on your notifications so you know when we upload a new video and we'll see you tomorrow.